Hey there guys, this is Mentor Shelly. I'm wanting to just address something I, you know, it just broke this morning that um, the movie The Banker, which I was so looking forward to as a career coach, as a, um, as a business professional, looking to really encourage and entice a different perspective as a melanated people. Um, from a career coaching standpoint, you want to also give young people a different perspective, not just one perspective on what happened in history and what is possible for them today. And um, what I always talk about um, in the in, in Forcing the Dream Career guide that you can, you know, you pretty much can f figure out what it is you like to do, what you want to do. And use a dream career guide, which you can go to mentorshelly.com forward slash DCG to get um, for free. Because I do offer that for free um, as of right now. There are going to be some other things added to it. And then there'll be a paid version as well. But the movie The Banker, um, which starred Samuel L. Jackson and Mr. Mackey, um, was talking about two men, Bernard Garrett and Joe Harris, about... The groundbreaking, um, the groundbreaking things that they did in the 1950s in California. Now, this is a story that must be told, and this is a story that must be distributed. And I think Apple TV and <clears throat> and and whoever else has ties to, you know, to putting this movie out is making a very horrible mistake by trying to pull the plug on such an important story. This is a more important story than even Harriet Tubman. Because, you know, to be honest with you, um, the slave story has been told three times science, three times to Sunday. And, you know, the, that narrative is, to be honest with you, dead. If they don't make another one, they don't make another one. But my honest opinion on this is that this story needs to be told. Because young people that are only seeing images of... Um, of men, especially men of mel <laughs> of melanated means, um, in one light as rappers or basketball players can actually see men of the 1950s. This is not the only story out there like that. This is just one of many. And these are the stories that need to be told. And these are the stories that our dollars should be supporting because these are the stories that are going to tell give you a full scope of who the black man or the black woman or the melanated people are versus the slave narrative or the oh you, you, you all you can be is a rapper or a basketball star or this or that in the entertainment space to be successful i am very disappointed and i i was actually planning on a personal level to sponsor at least 10 kids from my youth group back home to go and see this movie because it's it's giving a different perspective on who they are as black young people and because of quagmire and quite honestly because of quagmire and foolishness now the narrative is not being spun that in oh there's something wrong with some of the family members what does that have to do with telling the story there's a lot of things that that other people have done and that was that doesn't stop anybody from telling you know the story of a mobster <laughs> whether black white or indian doesn't stop them from telling the story of the person so i would say that i'd i'd appeal to apple tv to say listen this is not the movie for you not to release if you want your platform to be successful um this is a very important story you're about to turn on a whole lot of money by not releasing this film because I personally was going to put out at least a hundred dollars in tickets, not just for myself, but for other young people to be able to watch this type of narrative because the narrative of neg negative narratives are overplayed, done and over with. And this is the type of movie that is going to help young people to be more productive parts of society. However, um, that's all I have to say about that. I wanted to just bring that on here because I was really looking forward to not only seeing, you know, watching the story myself, 
but also having discussions about it and also using information from that movie to be able to speak to the young adults going into their careers and how they can approach it and see what this movie could bring and be able to have some talking points and some action points from it. But all right, guys, I just wanted to leave that with you. And of course, if you are looking to expand or figure out your next career move and you don't know where to start, you can definitely use my um, resource guide, the free resource guide that you can find at mentorshelly.com forward slash DCG, which is a dream career guide. You can put your information in and download the PDF. Um, if you're looking to support the channel in any other way, shape or form, whether it's working with me directly for your career um, dreams and visions, um, definitely go to mentorshelly.com forward slash shop and all of my products and services are available there. Thank you guys. Take care. I just wanted to put my two cents in as far as this particular movie was concerned because I really was looking forward to it. Apple TV, um, from one creator to the next, I think you're making a big mistake by holding this back because you are about to make billions of dollars off of this movie. All right. Take care, guys. You have a good one. And of course, if you have suggestions for the channel, you can definitely leave a comment below on the video or you can go to mentorshelly.com forward slash contact and you can leave me a voicemail or an email message and I'm more than happy to return those within the next 24 hours. Guys, take care. You have a good one.